Pop star David Adeleke, a.k.a. Davido, and his cousin Dele Adeleke have been on a warpath over the latter's interest in running against their uncle, Ademola Adeleke, in the Oshu State governorship race. On Tuesday, January 18, 29-year-old Davido stormed Twitter to drag his cousin for choosing to run against their uncle. The singer claims Dele struggled to graduate with a second-class lower and has not succeeded in building one single thing in his life on his own. He wrote, Wonderful, me, I finished uni with a 2-1, but it's cousin Dele who struggled to even get a 2-2 that is now forming intellectual. Intellectual that has not succeeded in building one single thing in his own life. This life, eh? Also, beware of fakes. The next day, the BET winner stormed Twitter again, this time accusing Daly of writing about the death of his mother in an article relating to his political ambition. Because of your ambition, you have your people write about me, which I don't care, but to include the death of my mother in an article, same woman that raised you, Daly Adeleke, okay now, Daly, God will judge you, he wrote. Feeling unsatisfied, Davido further threatened to expose his cousin to the people of Osho State, calling him a betrayal to the Adeleke family. He wrote, Dele, Mr. Fake Intellectual, you really dare to cross that line. You dare to include my mom's death in your lies about me. My mom that fed you and literally clothes your sorry <laughs> It is a shame. I promise to expose your ungrateful betraying to the whole ocean. With things spiraling out of control, Dele was forced to make a statement on Twitter denying the allegation against him. The governorship aspirant said that he would never sponsor any negative comment against Davido's mother as he lost his own mother at a young age. Addressing Davido, he wrote, Dear Davido, for whatever this is, what to you? Please note that I lost my mother at a tender age like you and would never allow anyone to generate her or her memory. I would never write nor say anything against my auntie Vero, who I cherish dearly. Dele also alleged that Davido's fans have been threatening him since the singer's outburst on social media. In his final tweet, Dele said that he respects Davido's decision to support their uncle, who is also contesting for the same position, adding that the people of Osu State deserve the best. I respect your decision and choice to support Uncle Demola, and this is the beauty of democracy. It is possible we can all make our individual choices without rancor and bitterness. We can all follow different paths and still live as one big happy family. The people of Osun, greatly deserving the best, will give the job to who they so deem fit and may the best man win. You will always remain dear to me. In an interview with Channel's Television, Mr. Adeleke said he is more competent than his uncle, who was the governorship candidate for the People's Democratic Party, PDP, in 2018. He also said that being Senator Adeleke's nephew should not hamper his aspiration to serve the people of the state. He stated that running for a political office is more about competence than political alliances and claiming to be the best candidate PDP can produce to challenge the incumbent governor, Boyega Oyetola, of the All Progressive Congress, APC.